Hello guys, what's up? My name is Israel and I am back with another video. This time I'm gonna be showing you Morelia, a beautiful city located in central Mexico, only three and a half hours away from Mexico City. Let me tell you, this city has become one of my favorite cities in Mexico. It's very beautiful. So I'm very excited to show Morelia to you. Let's get started. I hope you like this video and thank you very much for watching. Good morning guys, so welcome to Morelia. This city is known for being one of the most beautiful cities in Mexico. And I have been walking for a little while and I can confirm this city is really pretty. The capital city of Morelia is considered to be one of the most Spanish looking cities in Mexico and is known for its beautiful colonial architecture. I don't know if you've noticed, but most of the buildings are pretty much the same color and that's one of my favorite things about Morelia, the color of the buildings and the architecture. Uh, so most of the historic buildings in the historic center were constructed out of pink quarry stone. So this is the most well-known landmark of Morelia, it's called La Catedral de Morelia and is considered to be one of the most beautiful cathedrals in Mexico. It took 84 years to build and its construction began in 1660 and it was completed in 1744. I know 84 years sounds like a very long time but once you take a look inside and outside of the church, you can definitely see all the work they did, I mean the chandeliers, the organ the structures, everything was just so so nice, so I really like this place, so definitely you cannot miss La Catedral de Morelia. Alright guys, so now I am in El Acueducto de Morelia, which is actually very long. So this is definitely one of the most beautiful landmarks in Morelia, the Acueducto de Morelia, which was built in 1785, and it consists of 253 arches. Each arch measures around 9.24 meters tall, and in total, the Acueducto measures around 1,700 meters long. There is a fountain right in front of me. So, very near La Fuente de Tarascas and the Acueducto de Morelia, it's this beautiful place that I think it's probably my favorite spot in the city. It's so amazing, I think I was here every single day because <laughs> it's so beautiful. It's called El Callejón del Romance and it's an awesome place to come and just relax. There's usually not that many people and well, every time I went there it was pretty much empty. So it was very nice and it's a good place to have a date or just walk around. And yeah, it's really pretty, so make sure you come. I am next to a candy market, which is right there. And I was there yesterday and let me tell you, it's very nice. I recommend it a lot. Uh, it has all kinds of candies. So if you like Mexican candies, you cannot miss the Mercado de los Dulces. I like candies and I feel like the market definitely has one of the best uh, displays of candies.
That tree is called Bugambilias and they're very typical in Mexico, they're everywhere. So the original name of Morelia was Valladolid, but after the Mexican War of Independence, the city was renamed after Jose Maria Morelos. And also, in 1991, the historic center of Morelia was declared a World Heritage Site by the UNESCO. This is one of the most beautiful chapels I've seen in Mexico and reminds me a little bit of the chapel in Puebla called El Capilla del Rosario, but this one has its own charm. It's called El Santuario de Nuestra Señora de Guadalupe. It was built in 1708 and its construction took eight years. So far this street has been one of my favorites in Morelia. It's just so nice, I don't know, I really have liked Everything about Morelia has been so nice so far. Uh, the people are just so friendly. So far, it's been one of my favorite cities in Mexico, actually. I know I say that a lot, but I mean it. Another thing I really liked about this city is the food. They have very good food and very good restaurants. Some of them have actually very nice views. So these restaurants I'm going to show you are my favorite. I feel like they not only have very good service and views, but also the food is very nice. So if you like Mexican food, you're gonna love Morelia. So if you are traveling around Mexico, I recommend that you do your groceries in a mercado. Uh, it's definitely better than a supermarket because it's not only cheaper, but the fruit and the vegetables are so much more fresh and also you're supporting family business. So that's a good thing to do. This one was one of my favorite markets. It's called Mercado San Juan and it's not that near the historic center. You would have to walk at least 15 minutes or you can take a public transportation or a taxi. Alright guys, we are finished. I hope you enjoyed my short video about Morelia. I really enjoyed making this video and I really liked coming back to this beautiful city. This wasn't my first time in Morelia, I was here before, but this time I like it a lot more. I feel like I got to see so many new places. So if you are visiting central Mexico, definitely consider visiting Morelia because it's very beautiful. So goodbye for now, I'll see you guys on my next video. Take care and stay healthy.